Hey Rob, so who are you, whose performance are you excited to see tonight in the film? Well, believe it or not, the director is a really good friend of mine, so I've already had a chance to see this, and it's an incredible film, and, and Danny McBride and Nick Swartzen just have the most incredible chemistry. It's, it is truly, truly funny, and it's a great film. Now, if you were playing your own bank robbery, yeah. what would you buy in the dollar store? Man, I don't. I, I would just buy all black everything, and then go rob it at night. I wouldn't go in with a fake bomb and try to try, or with a bomb and try to force people to rob it. But I don't know. Like anyone else, I always like you know will watch stuff on like the ID channel about bank robbing and just think like, man, I could pull that. I, I, if you were smart enough, it would be real easy to rob a bank. You know, that's my thought process. So. And do you have a, a favorite robbery film, bank robbing film from the past that you like a lot? I mean, obviously Heat is the greatest bank robbery film of all time. But more than that, I lived through the North Hollywood bank, you know, bank robbery, like where we were watching it on TV, uh, you know, live, like live reality of where they thought 20 people robbed the bank and it was just two guys, you know. So that's not really a movie, but it was a lot of fun to see. Now, which character in the film do you think relates the most to yourself? Man, I don't, man, I'm going to say, I don't know, I'm, I'm kind of a controlling kind of crazy person. I think that'd have to be Danny McBride's character, you know, where he's just, but he's really dumb too. And I, maybe I'm a little bit dumb from time to time, but not quite that, but uh, probably him. What are you currently working on your project? Uh, right now, my, I own a professional skateboarding league, Street League Skateboarding, that our championship is live on ESPN on the 28th. Then I uh, have a new show on MTV coming out on the 29th called Ridiculousness. And I'm just finishing up my cartoon that I'm doing for Nickelodeon called Wild Grinders. And then start season five of Fantasy Factory in October. So it's moving. Now, what's the premise of your show on MTV? Is it reality-based again? No, this one is, is, is sort of a modernized... Uh, uh, America's Funniest Home Videos. It's like, if you can think of like a show like Tosh.0 has like 10 videos where it's all sketch comedy. Mine is like 45 videos where it's just videos, videos, videos. And it's just like me and my friends, like just watching them like you and your friends, watching them at home, you know. Simplifying it a little bit and just giving you the gold as opposed to, to trying too hard to produce it, you know. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. All right, good to see you again.